What's up, guys? Wow, much controversy erupted in the last video. I uh, ended up having to cut it short because, yeah, problems. So I want to talk, before we get into the gameplay again, I want to talk for a little bit about this game and this translation from DJAP from 2001. So... I, I really owe you guys an apology and I'll just be as blunt about this as I possibly can. I screwed up. Um, I didn't do enough research. I didn't realize what I was getting myself into and I didn't realize what I was getting you guys into either. So I apologize for the problem that we've had to deal with. Apparently this particular translation is infamous on the internet and i totally was not aware of that i am now and i understand that um, there were some things that i had seen here and there come like a uh, uh, text from different characters like comments characters were making in the game and stuff like that the reference to the porno magazine that sort of thing there had been some stuff that uh caught my attention and I thought it was a little weird, but whatever. I played through star ocean and it had, it had some stuff like that too in the translation. Well, as it turns out, uh, this particular translation is pretty well known for being bad. <laughs> they exaggerate it. Uh, like there's times where they exaggerate what the characters are saying. There's times where they completely change what the characters say. Uh, there's times where they go off the rails and they do some extremely explicit stuff in the translation for this game. Now, that doesn't mean that the that the actual game didn't have some explicit stuff as well. I'm really not trying to get into too much of that because I think there's some debate about this sort of thing, this particular issue. Um, but I will say that going forward, I will be a lot more selective and a lot more careful about the games that I choose and the translations that I choose because I don't want to have to deal with this type of a situation. You know, back in 2001, I don't think these guys gave two thoughts about what, you know, <laughs> YouTube streaming and stuff wasn't even a thing. It didn't even exist back then. You know, um, there were no concerns about like, going too edgy and how that would affect people that would want to play this on the internet. <laughs> uh, so it is what it is. Um, I'm really, I really am enjoying this game and I'm really going to try to put my thoughts about the guys that translated this. I'm going to try to separate that out and just appreciate this game as best I can. And appreciate the translation work as best I can. Now that I know that there are some issues, uh, yeah, that's going to be in, in my thoughts and in my mind. And that kind of sucks because I think it'll kind of take away a little bit of my enjoyment of this game. Um, and especially knowing that I had to cut out some of the game cause I just can't even show it to you because yeah, it's, I mean, maybe it would be fine but maybe it wouldn't be fine. You know what I'm saying? And I'm just not going to, you know, hopefully you guys understand what I'm talking about. So anyway, if there's more stuff that comes up, then that means I'm going to have to edit again. And that means that I, there might be more sections of the game that I can't show you that we can't include in this playthrough, which that really sucks. That's a really crappy thing. If, if a translation is so bad that it means that you're not going to be able to show people the translation, then that's a failure on the part of the people that did the translation. I appreciate very much the hard work that goes into trying to make these games available for Western audiences, but you know, I'm not going to sit here and say that, uh, you know, that I, that I think that it's cool that they're including things that are, or even that they're exaggerating things and twisting the story around to make it more fun and more edgy, more, you know, whatever. I, I, I don't like that. That's not cool. And it was unnecessary. It's completely unnecessary, but it is what it is. This is from 2001. So what are you going to do?
So anyway, that's enough yakking. We're going to get back into the game and we're going to try to have some fun and hopefully finish this game out without any more issues. And like I said, going forward, when I pick games that are from Japanese game, like releases of fan translations for Japanese games that never made it over here, I'm going to do a little bit more research and try to find out why it never made it over here. And if there's any kind of problems with the translations themselves, because there might be different versions that are better. I've been told the PlayStation version of this is a lot is is much better as far as the translation goes. I just didn't want to, you know, I wanted to play the Super Nintendo one. But, you know, it is what it is. Lessons have been learned and we move on. So thanks for listening to me yak about this. We're going to load our game and we're going to try to continue now. So thank you. All right. Let's get back into it. I hit the wrong thing. Sorry. Okay. So everybody's passed out since you guys missed out on what happened. <laughs> um, yeah, everybody got drunk at a, at a bar and there was some stuff that went on and this person that we met turns out to be a treasure hunter and uh is possessed by evil spirit so now i gotta go track this person down and hopefully everybody will be okay not sure where to go we'll find out together is that a cat yeah what's up key cat Captain, do something. She's spazzing out. Don't know if that's what the actual Japanese text was, but that's what they're saying here in this translation. Who is that woman? I'm also scared for different reasons, though. Okay. <clears throat> Welcome. It <laughs> just says welcome. All right. At least he's consistent. Okay. There. Mia, wake up. It help me. Whoa. Okay. Here we go. Wasted all my skill points. Hmm. 
Cliss, are you all right? Mia seemed possessed. Perhaps by an agent of Deus sent to kill us. That's not important. This means Deus knows who we are and where we are headed. Mm hmm. Thank you. My pleasure. We've all got to start helping each other out. See ya. Thanks, Captain Crunch. Yeah, I don't think that... Start... Uh, yeah, anyway, whatever. Thank you very much. We've got to get to the castle to save the prince. Don't worry. I've got a plan. I'll tell you when we get in the inn. Alrighty. My dad's a sailor and gets to travel. He won't let me go with him, though. He just doesn't know how the world really is. Impossible. Another ship over there. Alvinista is running low on food, so they have to import rice from Belladum. I don't know if it's a good idea. Poor Alvinista, having to import rice from Belladum, how humiliating. But it's better than starving. That's true. Welcome to Alvinista. We're one of the few countries with elves working here. Even the king has some elven blood in him. Cool. Guess we'll go this way. This one's back over here. Some house. There are many people <clears throat> wanting to hunt treasure in Moria. They hang out at the guild here in town. Gotcha. There's the inn. That's where we need to go. No, that's just a, a sign saying there's an inn here. I got you. I get you. There's the item shop. There's the inn. I give out prizes to the fastest person in town. I'm bored. <laughs> okay. The night stay is 40 gold. Pay for a room? Sure. A good rest. Oh, yeah. Deos has already infiltrated the throne room here. I suggest we sneak into the castle. How are we going to do that? We've got to get to the prince before Deos realizes what is going on. Well, we can't just walk in through the gate. Well, that's true. But if we could get in onto the balcony. Hmm. <laughs> Archie. Oh, no. You don't mean... You can't be serious. Well, I could try to do you one at a time. I'm sure whoever it is that's after the prince will be near his room. It's a new moon tonight, so we should go while it's dark. Don't you think we need a little more time to prepare? Uh, head in the castle. Yeah, we need a little more time. We need a day to prepare, yes. <clears throat> Yeah, I didn't want to jump into that if we don't have to, so that's a good point. All right. Let's see what we can buy around here. Maybe some good weapons. Who knows? Alvanisa used to be ruled by an elf. Welcome. 
We've got bread, cream cheese, all kinds of Twinkies, mackerel. Hmm. Okay. That's it there. Healing mana operates on a system similar to photosynthesis in plants, but it works for animals by repairing broken cells and energizing them with sugars and proteins. How does it work? Magic. <clears throat> Elves are so beautiful. Wish I could be so lovely. But I'm working on it. I only eat organic foods. <laughs> well, good luck with that. Okay. Oh, can't go that way. There's an item shop here. Let's go in that. What can I do you for? I don't think we need any of this stuff. I think we pretty much... Yeah, we're okay. We're good. My grandmother told me that the unicorn lives in a white forest to the west of the Valhalla Plains. Really? Okay. The unicorn will only meet the most pure of girls. Adventurers Guild. Okay. Uh, I think I had one too many beers. Hey, buddy. I'll sell you this sword technique book real cheap. Really? How cheap? Well, I'm not exactly giving it away, but uh, I'd be willing to part it for uh, 6000 Uh Sure. Cyan Storm. Mm, okay. Nice doing business with you. How can you possibly stay alert when you're so drunk? <clears throat> Cyan Storm. Interesting. Let's put that on one of them. That'll work. Permission to Moria is expensive. I'm on the waiting list for permission to get into the Moria gallery. <clears throat> there are treasures abound in the Moria gallery. Bet there are. The dwarves used to mine the Moria caverns for rare metals. Hmm. Don't you want to come back to my place? Oh boy, here we go. What a couple of sluts. Oh wow. Yeah, I don't think that's accurate translation either. Oop, I didn't mean to do that again. There, get away from that. You sure don't want to come... Uh, nope. The Mori Gallery is located in the south of here. When you get to the harbor, go east along the coast. Okay. I gotta have a drink to warm up my hands. Tell you what, for a thousand gold, I'll tell you a secret. Wanna know? All right. It's Kikorimu. Kikorimu. This will help you get into the Cave of Spirits. Kikarimu. Okay. Hopefully that's worth it. It's no place for children. Okay, sheesh. Alright, see you guys later. <clears throat> there are many people wanting to hunt treasure in Moria. They hang out in the guild here in town. I already talked to you, I think. Pretty sure I did, big boy. Is there a weapon shop around here anywhere? That would be pretty cool. Maybe down this way? <clears throat> hey, come here, buddy. What are you doing? 
We were praying to a sky god. Sky god? Yeah, there are many spirits in the sky. I'm just here because all my friends are doing it. <laughs> okay. Okay, so there's got to be a weapon shop around here. Oh, there's an armor shop. And there's a weapon shop. Let's go in the weapon shop first. What do you got, buddy? A lot of great weapons for sale here. I'll be the judge of that. All right. That's not a good one. I already have that one. There's an axe. Halibird. Combines the best qualities of the axe and spear. It's pretty good. Epi. Mm. Bardish. Gemrod. She already has that. Ruby Rod. That's better. Much better, actually. Alright, we'll do one of those. And... Yeah, I think we'll do one of those. <clears throat> Would you like me to wrap that up for you? Nah, we're good. And over here is the armor shop. See what you got over here. Okay, breastplate. That looks pretty good. Already got that. Gauntlet. Knight shield. I think we already have that. Silver cloak. Oh, wow. I definitely want to get that. Panama hat. Blue ribbon. Oh, we can give that to her. We already have a blue ribbon. Jet boots, and that's it. Okay, so two of those. Silver Cloak, one, two, three of those. Gauntlet, one of those. Breastplate, one of those. And that's it. All right. Let's, oop, I didn't mean to do that. I always do that. Damn it. Get away from there. All right. Let's equip our, our stuff. Boom. 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 And boom. There we go. Cool. <clears throat> we got good stuff now. Let's get rid of the old stuff. We don't need that. We don't need that. We don't need you. We don't, I don't. I haven't found a use for these boots, but I'm going to hold on to them because I feel like there is a use. I just don't know what it is. I'm not sure about the pickaxe either. Porno magazine. Um, could probably sell that, but we'll just hold on to it. <clears throat> And the rope, we'll hold on to the rope. We don't need that. We don't need that. We don't need that. Or that. Or the regular ribbon. Or the cloak. All right, that's good. Yep. <clears throat> All right. Make sure everybody, I just want to double check. Just make sure everybody has their equipment. Yeah, okay. We're good. All right. Good. We got good stuff. <clears throat> so that's why we didn't want to just move on right away. We got to see what's going on in this place. I don't think anyone's ever going to beat that kid. Try your luck at a sprint race. How about it? Uh... Yeah. Need an explanation? Yes. The race runs around the perimeter of the town walls three times. If you want to cancel the race, come back to me. You're not allowed to leave town or enter someone's house or shop during the race. Want me to detail the course for you? Yes. I'll show you around. Pay careful attention. The race starts here at this yellow line 
on the east end of town. Then head up to the main avenue of the town. <clears throat> head west, but keep to the north end. Okay. I'm gonna go around those trees. You get to the dead end, begin to circle around to the north. Circle back down south. <clears throat> I don't know if I can remember this. <clears throat> back up that way then you'll be back on the main street but stay to the south this time okay then just run back up here to the yellow line well crap I don't know if I can do it but I can give it a shot That's <laughs> playing the. That's funny. Ah, I screwed up. I screwed this all up. I screwed that all up. Give up. Yeah, I give up. It's playing music from uh what what is that game? Rally X or is it something else? That's pretty funny. Namco game. Oh man. Yeah, I don't think I can do this. Yeah, I'm not gonna worry about it. I would like to do it though. <clears throat> I would. I'm gonna try it one more time. Yeah, we'll try it. Oh, crap. I didn't realize. Okay. At least I finished it. <clears throat> Alright, whatever. What the hell? Look, a bush baby. Okay. What? <laughs> okay. I don't know. Weird. Well, 
that goes out. Okay. North means death. Remember that. Okay. Hey, Owen, Nancy. Hey, look. Oh, hey, Cliss. It's been a while. So, you really left home, huh? Yeah, but it's time for me to start making my own way in the world. And I've got Nancy now. That's all that matters. We were going to Midgard, but... We're going to stay here in Al, uh, Albanista for a while because of the war. Don't tell my father where we are, okay? Yeah, no problem. Please take care of yourself, Nancy. Thanks, Mint. The price of items differs from town to town. If you buy low and sell high, you can make a lot of money. That's a good point. <clears throat> buy something, will you? Thief's mantle, t -t -t rabbit's foot, allows you to escape battles 30% faster, a holy rune, increase your max hit point by 5%, battle rune, oh that's pretty good, has the time needed to cast a magic spell, it's an expensive ass rune right there, that's what they're talking about. Prices are different. Poison amulet. Protect the wearer from poison. That might be really useful at some point, actually. Protects the wearer from paralyzation. It's another one that might be really useful. Hmm. Well, I have to keep that in mind. Get some good stuff here, guy. I'll check you later. Yeah, we've already been. Yeah, already done all that. Let's over here. Let's talk to this guy. Runglum is a full-blooded elf, but humans raised him, so he feels more comfortable with them. Can't go in there. Oh, I knocked. Sounds like a cat. <laughs> Sounds like a dog. Interesting. Okay. My grandparents <clears throat> worried that the war will reach Alvinista. Yeah, probably so. All right. My son went to Midgard and I'm worried about him. I understand why. I'm leaving town before our damn government starts a war. Damn government. My grandparents worry that the war will reach Alvinista. Yeah. I already went there. I already been up there. Okay. Well, I think we're ready to move on to the inn. What's this guy doing over here? Oh. Everyone adores Princess Charles. He's cute, good with the people, can even use magic, but he's been hiding away in the castle lately. All right, for real this time. Yes. You sure? Yes. Let's do it.
We're all back together now. Let's go check out the prince's bedroom, but be quiet about it. Uh-oh. Gotta be careful. Who's there? Show yourself. Oh. Can't afford to be caught. Let's sneak by when the guards aren't looking. Okay. Where are we? It's too dark to see. Who dares disturb my sleep? I'm Alvinus's crown prince. How dare you enter my room? The prince's room? Assassins in my room! Uh-oh. Uh-oh. We're in for it now! The guards are coming! Yes, the guards are on their way. You're gonna get it. There's no way out. There's something fishy about the prince, like he's being controlled. Huh? Look at that bird. What? <laughs> That's what is controlling the prince. Quick, catch it before it gets away. Yamir. I'm Yamir. Remember that name when you're burning in hell. I didn't think you'd make it this far. But now I'll take matters into my own hands. Let's go. Ouch. Thanks. Appreciate it, man. Oh, crap. Oh. Ow.
Ouch. This is not good. That didn't go very well. That was a mess. That was just a mess. Yeah. Okay. Crap. Oh, I gotta do all this again. Because I didn't save it. Well, I'll spare you guys that. Okay, we're gonna try this again. Here we go. Okay, here we go, y'all. Come on. 
Oh, hell yeah. Hell yeah. Actually, didn't think I was going to be able to do that. Oh, man. Good job, everybody. The Prince. My head. I can't remember. Who are you? We were... Guards! No! Are you alright, your highness? I'm fine. No thanks to you. Seize them! Yes, my liege. You're under arrest for treason to the crown of Albanista. Damn. What are we gonna do? Don't worry. I'll think of something. My skin will get all pasty if I stay here. We can't make them listen to us. It looks like we tried to kill the crown prince. We're not staying here. This food is awful. Do you think the prince will remember what happened? I hope so. If he does, we're saved. Guards, take them to the throne room. The throne room? Yes, sir. Runeglom. Hmm. My name's Runeglom. I'm the court wizard, an advisor to the king. His highness wants to ask you a few questions. See, I knew we'd be okay. I don't know, Archie. I don't know. Why did you sneak into the castle? We came to save the prince. How ridiculous. Who do I need to be saved from besides you? Son, don't speak until spoken to. Danos, Deos sent one of, uh, excuse me. Deos sent one of his underlings to control the prince. Does he want to drag us into the conflict at Midgard's Al Does he want to drag us into the conflict as Midgard's ally? We want to challenge Deos, but we can't do it without magic. Well, I just wanted to make sure why you why you were here. I had a feeling you weren't really after my son's life. The fight against Deos could use spirited young people like you was i really possessed by an agent of deos yes for this reason i think it's best that alvanista stay out of this war it's almost as if what deos wants is for us to get involved what haven't you heard midgard is on the brink of war with deos and they want Alvanista to join them in the fight. Yes, we heard. I'd really prefer for Alvanista itself to remain neutral. But you have my full support in overthrowing Deos. Once you feel you've attained the power. Thank you, your highness. We found this on the body of the demon you killed. Please take it. It's an incantation book. And this is for you, Sir Kles. This is Gungnir, Gungnir. This weapon was forged during the time of the gods and used by Odin himself. Unfortunately, it's lost much of its power since then. Please feel free to revisit our castle anytime. Thank you again, your highness, but we have one last request of you. May we have permission to enter the Moria Gallery? 
Moria? Why? I believe that there's a ring in Moria that will allow me to contract with the spirit of the moon. I see. I will have the proper papers drawn up. You can pick up the documents from the guild in town a few days from now. Your Highness, I should get back to my research. I'm going back to my room. Received the Garnet Ring, Gungnir, and Opal, Opal's Q. Something like that. Take care. Take it easy, okay? Queen Marie. I'll keep you in my prayers. Come back and visit anytime. Cool. I'm the chambermaid. <laughs> I don't know why that struck me funny. I'm the chambermaid. <laughs> I'm in danger. <laughs> Let me go see the prince again. What's up, prince? I hope I can be as good a king as my father is. Well, you know, sometimes you feel like your father... Sometimes you feel like your mother. She's never satisfied. Welcome to Alvinista Castle. Yes. Why not try your luck at a test of skill? I've got prizes for you if you win. Need an explanation? No. Try your luck? No. I'm not interested. Sorry. I don't have time for your little games. I'm playing a video game. Would you like to listen to the legend of this book? Uh, okay. There are three types of magical books. Some of them contain spells for the mage. Others contain instructions. Uh, excuse me, on how to perform weapon techniques for a swordsman. Lastly, there's a book that the summoner uses to write down the proper incantation to call a given magical spirit. Cool. Being a guard isn't as easy as it looks. I don't know anything about magic. Maybe the people in the research center can help you. Wait, I do know one story. Once upon a time, there were no monsters. Then one day someone covered the world in poison in the hopes of ruling the world. The spirits led by the moon spirit fought every day against the dark power. But one night the moon spirit didn't come and darkness reigned. Then the dark spirits crown themselves kings. I don't remember the rest of the story. Eh. That was pretty good, though. Good, good job, dude. It's not bad. It's a wonderful thing for an elf and a human to fall in love. Elves have begun to let certain individuals back into their village. In Midgard, there are, uh, they are researching science, the new power combined with magic. They call it Mystech. Not Magitech, like in Final Fantasy. Mystech. How great it'd be for humans to be able to use magic just like elves. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Did I already go up here? Talk to this guy? Oh. I'm happy to see you all turned out to be the good guys. The prince means a lot to us. Yep. What is this? Hey, you half elf, I can sell you some spells. Which ones are you interested in? Tractor beam or thunder blade? Wow. Thunder blade. That one costs 12,000. It's worth it. Uh, yeah, we'll do that. Thunderblade. Just like the video game. This guy works for Sega. Fire Spirit Ifrit lives in a cave in the Freeland Desert. 
Larth. We need permission to enter the Moria Gallery, don't we? You can pick up the proper papers from the Adventurers Guild. It's underneath the pharmacy in the southwest, southwest corner of town. I got you. Cool. How much money do I have? 20,000. Can I buy this other spell too? Yeah. We'll get tractor beam. 4,000. Yes. Cool. We're learning. Just like in the real world, if you want an education, you got to pay for it. Spirits? All I know is the water spirit. Undyne lives in a cave on a small island north of Venezia. And the earth spirit, Gnome, lives in a cave to the east of Belladoom. Does that help you at all? Hmm, that might, actually. It might be very helpful. Magic would be a wonderful thing to use. There's some kind of connection between science and magic. You need to focus more. Pardon me if I speak in algorithms. Uh, I've been working all night long. Okay. Well, you guys keep it up. Good work. Good work. Did I already... Oh, that's where they are. Okay. Can't get out that way. I thought it was just here. It was just here. How do I get out of this damn place? It goes down to the, oh, down this way. And then find a way out of here. Not that way. There we go, down this way. This is a library. I think elves are afraid humans will learn how to use magic. It would detract from their individuality. Forbidden Magic Volume 1. Some magic is prohibited. The first is a form of magical sacrifice where the caster expires himself, releasing an enormous amount of magical energy. This creates a barrier around you that nothing can penetrate. Scholars are debating on whether this practice is a failed attempt to increase one's power or used as a last resort to protect others. Interesting. I think that's going to come back to be relevant at some point. Ancient Dialects, Volume 1. The ancient cultures had two forms of their language. Uh, the first was their formal dialect, which dates back over 10,000 years. There was, also, uh, there was also a dialect used for everyday speaking. Our language today is actually a combination of these two dialects. Many ancient tablets are written in the formal dialect. Okay. The moon and stars. There are two moons orbiting our world. The first is Silver Silveranto, and the second is Tessalia. Tessa Tessila. Tessila. Okay, I don't know. Silveranto takes 35 days to revolve around our planet, while Tessalia takes about 42. There are also several meteors circling our planet, which we can see only with a telescope. Hmm. Magic is a healing force. Magic is used for destructive purposes, but there is a way to use magical power for healing. No one has discovered how to do this yet. Okay. So how do you know that there's a way to do it? I don't know. I'm a little confused there, but all right. Everyone talks about how horrible the war is, but it hasn't affected me at all. Oh, well then, never mind. I guess it's great. Uh, 
Oh, prison cells. Okay. That's where we were at earlier. The Ymir forest is set upon a large lake. I bet it's beautiful. The music in the castle needs to be updated. Don't you think? It is. <laughs> That's funny. Uh, I love this music. The elves are upset that Alvanista and Midgard are allies. I wonder why. I wonder why too. All right. Well, that's the castle. Now we're back in town. And let's stay at the inn again. Because that's what we need to do. For sure, for sure. For sure, for sure. All right. We need to buy some stuff. I think because I used some stuff, it'd probably be a good idea. Let's see. What can we buy? Not a lot. That's all food stuff. We don't actually want that. We want uh, other things. I'm going to find a, an item shop. Yeah, that's what we want down there. There we go. Oh yeah, we got to go to the uh, downstairs to talk to those guys. Yeah, I want those, want that, that, need that. Cool. Thanks. All right, now we'll head down here and get our papers. Maybe. Permission to Moria is expensive. Yes, I know. Where do we get our papers from? Is this where permission slips to Moria are picked up? Yes. Let's see. There's one here for a Kles Av Alvain. Is that you? Please sign here. Yeah, we can go to Moria now. Fight the Balrog. Maybe not the Balrog, we'll see. Good luck, but you won't get as far as you want. A dead end? We'll see. Let's take a look around some other places before we head to Moria. That might not be such a bad idea. Plus, it's your decision. Okay, well, let's do it. Take a look around. Uh, I think I had one too many beers. Yeah, I think you did too. Oh yeah, the unicorn. Alrighty. Oh, this is yummy. I love to cook. It makes me so happy. That's good. Hope that one day I can live in peace with my family. But I fear Avanista will be dragged into a senseless war. Yeah, probably so. All right, y'all. There are many people uh, wanting to hunt treasure in Moria. They hang out at the guild. Yeah, I got you. Can't go in there. Oh, woman's voice. Quick, put your pants on. I think my husband is home. Not again. Oh, this freaking translation. I don't even know anymore. Trying to have fun. Just trying to appreciate it. These guys. Hey, come here, buddy. Come here, buddy. Relax, guy. What are you doing? We're praying to the sky god. Sky god? Yeah, I say. 
There are many spirits in the sky. Relax, buddy. <laughs> I'm just here because all my friends are doing it. Word. Such is life. Rungal is a full-blooded elf, but humans raised him, so he feels more comfortable with them. I remember that. Sounds like a cat. That's what it sounds like. But is it? My grandparents worry that the world reach of Anista. Yep. I already talked to you, and I already talked to them. Yep. I got you. Let's go upstairs. Oh, let's talk to our friends again. Price of items differs down to town, blah, blah, blah. I got you. Don't tell my father where we are, okay? No problem. Yep, I got you. North means death. Remember that. I got you. North bad. I don't think anyone's ever going to beat that kid. Yep, probably not. This is where the, yeah. The bush baby. Strange. Okay. All right. I don't know. I don't think there's anything else to do here. I think we're ready to go to Moria. Check this out. Yeah, I already talked to you. First things first, save it. All right, let's see if we can figure out where we're supposed to go. Moria. Moria, Moria. Oh, wow. What is that? Yeah. Kick some ass. Hell yeah. Use that crap they were using on me. Okay. Oh, what's this? What is this? What the hell's that? You hear that? It sounds like a cuckoo. Hello? Who's there? What are you doing out here? Nothing. Sorry to bother you. Okay, I guess we're not supposed to be over here. Hmm. Okay. Anything up here? Okay, well, check on this side, huh? Okay, guess we're not supposed to be here. Well, onward we go. We gotta go all the way around here, or do we go down this way? Nope, we gotta go around that way. Get him. Hit him with that. Good job. Hey, there's another place we can go to. What is this? Hey, you swordsman. Are you interested in learning a new skill? Burning soul. Well, that was easy. You just straight up gave it to me. Nice. Thanks. How nice it must be to travel. Yeah, it is. Been trying to reach my life's goal for 10 years. Still haven't succeeded. Well, maybe you got a lot more to live than you think you do. Okay. That it? That's it. That's all there is there, and I can't go further. Okay. 
Well, we're not getting to Moria that way. Clearly, I am going the wrong way here. Pretty powerful stuff right there. Where the hell am I supposed to go? Oh, here's a little spot. What is this? It's a dock. Uh -huh. You'll need a miner's axe if you want to get from the fifth floor to the sixth floor of the Moria Gallery. Another adventurer told me that. Okay, well, that's good to know. Here's a legend. Many years ago, there was a soldier who traveled to another kingdom. I know the first part. Tell me the end. Then some of the other evil spirits took the moon spirit and trapped her in darkness. Then they sprayed poison all over the world, which poisoned everything and everyone, even the evil spirits. Thankfully, there were some mana users who could uh, counteract the poison and a century passed. The whole world began again. This is the only part of the legend I can remember. Okay, that's pretty cool. Yeah, that's the ship that we came in on, I think. Okay, there's a red spot way over to the right. That might be where we need to go. Let's take a look over here real quick. There's frogs all over the place here. Toads. So long, Kermy. Oh, a hidden place. Who are you? I'm afraid only elves are allowed this way. We've got to find a way in here. No entrance. Okay, not going in there yet. That's okay. I'm not supposed to be over here yet. No problem. 
Nothing over here. I guess we should have gone the other way. Uh. A giant. Good work. If we can sleep here and rest, save our game, figure out where we're going, how to get to Moria. Let's see. I bet we can. Oh, there's no save spot, and I can't sleep here. <laughs> Damn it. Couldn't get that lucky, could I? Okay. No problem. Welcome. Okay. We're going to go to Moria. We got to go, oh, not, not back where we just came from. Going to go around this. There it is. Right there. Is this Moria? Moria Gallery, floor one. You can't enter the Moria Gallery without permission from His Highness, the King of Alvinista. We've got permission to enter from Alvinista's King. I see. Please pass. Yeah, thanks. Yeah, we got it. We got it. We're good. Hey, what's up? Oh, there's bad guys here. Oh, look at the little dudes. Midgets. I love midgets. Those are some seriously small midgets. I've seen small people, but I've never seen people that small. Can't carry any more orange gummies. Well, I can use one. this lever. Yes. Can that open the stairs there or something else? What kind of bad beating them up, you know?
How's this? Hmm. So you're zooming down or to your right? Okay, it's over to the left. Tech ring, stake, two thousand gold. Pull the lever, yes. Wonder what that did. Let's see if we can run away. I don't really want to fight these guys. Well, I guess we will since we're using all the. <laughs> Couldn't even run away. All right. Okay. Head back the way we came. Thunderblade is no joke. Yeah. 
And I forgot to change my weapons. I got all that new stuff and I forgot to equip it. I just realized that. <laughs> I wasn't even thinking about it. Yeah, we gotta heal Archie. Ring. Black Onyx. Maximum hit points by 30. Yeah, we'll do that. You need that for sure. We got a talisman and nothing else. We'll give you the protect ring. Okay, we're gonna save it here. We got a we got a long way to go inside this Moria place, and there's a lot more gameplay in this game, which we'll dive back into in the next part. Thanks for watching. Thanks for joining me, and I'll see you guys next time. Take care. <laughs>